Okay guys, welcome back. Now, as I was mentioning in the previous video, if your focus right now is on learning the features of ES2015 and you want to hold off on TypeScript, then I have an alternative setup. So go to Google and type scratch.js and over here, click on the Chrome Web Store link. Now, what is scratch.js? Let me read off the description because it is pretty clear. This extension is an add-on for DevTools, which integrates both the Tracer and Babel transpilers, allowing you to test out the new JavaScript features coming with ECMAScript 6, also known as ES6 or ES2015. So go ahead and add this to Chrome. I've already done that. And now to get started with Scratch.js, hit the F12 key and over here in DevTools, navigate to scratch.js okay once you're here click on toggle output and this is going to split our browser screen on the left is where we type our es2015 code and on the right is where it is going to display the es5 code so es6 transpile to es5 let me quickly show you an example so let a is equal to 5 and console dot log a now if you had a look over here when i was typing it was automatically showing the output for the es5 file as well so let is a feature in es6 and that gets transpiled to a, a var which is in es5 now to run this code click on run let's go to our console and if you see here we have output 5 so console dot log 5 and output 5 so this is the easiest way I could think of where you can even execute as you're learning from the video on the left ES6 code on the right ES5 code run it and you have your output on the console so this is restricted to ES 2015 features only you cannot do this with TypeScript but hope this helps you all thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one